would speak in opposition of the project. In opposition of the project, you have 15 minutes total time for this for this uh, session, please. So, uh, if you will, we're ready to start. Anyone that might want to speak in opposition, come to the podium and state your name, please. Good evening, everyone. My name is Mary Jones. I'm a citizen here in Cook County. Um, my address is 101 Pine Street, Sparta, Georgia. Um, good evening, Mr. Whitlock, Mayor and Council. I come before you today as a concerned citizen. I grew up here and I do love this town. Um, I'm asking that you vote no on the rezoning for the wood pellet manufacturing plant because we need to breathe. This company's air permit application shows that it will release nearly 800 tons of regulated air pollutants per year. This is a huge amount of, har of harmful air pollution. These pollutants include 100 tons of fine particles, which are linked to premature death, heart disease, aggravated asthma, and other health issues. The health of all citizens will be impacted those with asthma and COPD will especially be impacted by high cost of repeated sicknesses and medical visits. I do have a nephew that has asthma, so I know how hard it is for him to, to breathe and recover from um, air pollution. So um, neighbors of the existing wood pellet plants have complained about their properties being coated in wood dust and soot. Government workers also revealed that neighbors of these plants have complained about the dust, soot, and the smoke. From at least nine of the nine, at least nine of the 22 industrial wood pellet plants in the southern U.S. These pollutants include 250 tons of nitrogen oxides, which causes smog and acid rain, 216 tons of volatile organic compounds, and thousands of pounds of hazardous air pollutants that are especially toxic and cancer causing even in low quantities. Acetaldehyde, acrolein, arsenic, and formaldehyde are some of the most prominent and most dangerous of them all. We cannot contain the air, it blows and goes everywhere. Furthermore, AL does not have an emergency room in its hospital to provide care for those who will suffer from the pollution released by this plant. We want jobs to come to ADL but we don't, want the, we don't want the job to pollute our air and make us sick. Our community has suffered as COVID-19 COVID hotspot and the long-term effects have yet to be seen. Council members, I, I elected you to serve us. Please don't sell us out for 50 to 70 jobs. Please protect the health and well-being of the citizens of Cook County. Cook County citizens deserve better. Please vote no on the rezoning of this land. We are asking to let us read. Thank you. Thank you. Is there any questions from the council? No, sir. Okay. All right. Uh, anyone else in the audience want to speak against the project? Mayor, I think you have a list. Well, here comes Mr. Marshall. Go ahead, sir. Good evening once again, ladies and gentlemen.